Okay, so we have here another problem uh, on AC power and power factor. So this problem, we will we'll try to solve this one. So we have solved for the real and reactive power of 30 kVA system with a power factor of 0 0.8 lagging. Okay, so let's have the solution. So our given, so our capacity of the system is 30 kVA, so that will be our parent power. So this is 30 kVA or 30 kilovolt, 30,000 kilovolt ampere. So we have 30,000 volt ampere because 30 k that is. 30,000. Okay, so kilo is equal to 1,000. 30 kilovolt until uh, 30,000 volt ampere. Then our power factor is 0 0.8 lagging. 0 0.8. So the lagging on that um, uh, on the power factor it means that the angle, the power factor angle is negative or it lags. Uh, the the current lags the voltage a certain um, a certain electrical degrees so if you are going to write that one so that that will be a negative angle in our phase or diagram but in this point we are just trying to get the real and reactive power so there's no need for us to have the phase or diagram okay so we'll now solve for our real power. So going back to the formula of phase of a power factor. So power factor is equal to the real power over the apparent power. And we could uh, solve for the real power by basic algebraic manipulation. So we have power factor times uh, the apparent power so we could substitute the given so we have 0 0.8 times the apparent power which is equal to 30,000 volt ampere okay so we will use our calculator so 30,000 times 0.8 so this will be equal to 24,000 watts okay 24,000 watts or this will be equal to so 24,000 that is 24k so 24 kilo watts Okay, then we will solve now for our uh, reactive power. So we know that the apparent power is equal to the square root of our the square root of our real power time uh, plus the square of the reactive power. So if you are going to square bo both sides. and get uh, and solve for q so we could say that q is equal to the apparent power squared minus the real power squared then solving for q so that would be equal to square root of um, the apparent power square minus the real power then we will substitute our given and the real power that we have solved earlier okay so we have that will be equal to is that um 30,000 30,000 square minus 
So our Q is now equal to So let's have this one using our calculator So we have 30 So we could use this shortcut Kilo So that is x speed because kilo is equal to 10 raised to the power of negative 3 so this is times 10 raised to then you will put the 3 so i will make a separate video on how to use this calculator the 570 es calculator especially um using it um in your advantage during the uh, exam 24 x speed 3 so you have so this will be equal to okay i forgot to have this squared uh, that's why i was confused on the answer this all small 3 squared minus 24 xp 3 squared so you have 18,000 so this will be equal to 18,000 so this the unit for reactive power is var okay. volt ampere reactive and this is now your answer